The Tea Time Reservations program allows you to add Tea Time Reservations directly in your Jonas system, open Tea Sheets, as well as navigate through open Tea Sheets, and use the functions available within the program. Let's take a look at how to navigate through the Tea Sheet in the Tea Time Reservations program. In order to access a Tea Sheet, navigate to Tea Time Management, Processing, and Tea Time Reservations, or through Point of Sale, Chip Processing, Start a New Chit, and the Tea Time Reservations button. Note that you must access the Tea Time Reservations module through Point of Sale in order to check players in if you charge for rounds played. The middle area of the screen that you see here is a grid view style which will list all the tea times on the left side of the screen, the player slots across the top, and blank slots as well as tea time reservations in the center. The style of the grid will be dependent on the tea sheet template being used. Double clicking on an empty slot will allow you to add a reservation, and double clicking on a current reservation will allow you to edit it. The following icons will appear on a tea time reservation if applicable to that reservation. Note that icons will only appear on a reservation if they have been flagged to do so, most of which are flagged in Tea Time Management, Files, System Profile, in the Tea Sheet screen under the Other Display Options section. At the top of the screen, you will find the navigation bar, which has the following options Quick Booking slash Detailed Booking. This button will always display the opposite method of what is set as the default booking method and allows you to make a reservation using the method specified on the button. Move Selection allows you to easily move a reservation by selecting one or more players on the T-sheet, clicking the Move Selection button, and selecting where you'd like to move that reservation to. After selecting the time slot, go ahead and click Paste at the top of the screen. Copy Selection works the same way as the Move option, but will copy the reservation. Both options allow you to move or copy one or multiple reservations to the same or a different day, depending on the applicable booking restrictions. Tea Time Request will display and allow you to record requests for tea times. Resources can be used to search for available resources for carts, caddies, rental clubs, and GPS units, and if they are in use for a specific day or a range of dates. Golf carts, used to display the availability of golf carts and their schedule. Golf course delay, here you can delay or advance all the tee times on a course for a day and notify all players if desired. Statistics, will display statistics for the course and tea sheet. And tea sheet updates, which will display updates made to the tea sheet and can be viewed by all or specific type of update. Updates can be seen for individual as well as a range of dates. Below the navigation bar, you will find the following options. Recycle icon. Click this icon to switch between the available golf courses that you have access to. You can also switch between the golf courses by clicking on the golf course name, which indicates which golf course is currently being displayed. The information icon will display the course amenities, directions to the course, and the golf course policies. Clicking today's tea sheet will jump the screen to today's tea sheet and current time. You can utilize the left and right arrows to navigate through the tea sheet dates. Alternatively, you can click on the date and select the tea sheet you'd like to view. You can also use the expanded view button to view four months worth of tea sheets. The calendar icon allows you to choose a specific date that you'd like to jump to that T-sheet for. Clicking on the time icon will jump the screen to that current time, whereas the clock icon will allow you to choose the time you'd like to jump to. On the right-hand side of the screen, you will find the following options. Exit will close the program. Open T-sheet 
will provide you with the ability to open one or multiple T-sheets. Conditions allows you to record weather conditions for the course, date, and time. T-sheet notes used to create and read both internal and external notes specific to the T-sheet you are viewing. If there are any notes, the T-Sheet Notes button will be highlighted on the screen for you. Print T-Sheet will open the Where Would You Like It Printed window, allowing you to view, print, and email the current T-Sheet activity. Squeeze Tea Time allows for the addition of another not previously defined time slot to the currently open T-Sheet. Refresh T-Sheet will manually refresh the T-Sheet data. Note that the T-Sheet does automatically refresh quite often depending on your tea time workstation settings. Line up and line down can be used to move the T-Sheet one slot at a time, where page up and page down will move between one page at a time. Lastly, across the bottom of the screen you will find the following options. At a glance, we'll switch to the at a glance view of the T-Sheet allowing you to switch between golf courses, tee sheets, and filter what is displayed on the player availability and time of day. Click the tee sheet button to close the at a glance view. If you click the exit button, it will close you out of the tee time reservation program. Search. Use the search parameters to locate open reservations for any members or guests that have previously been booked. Inquiry allows you to locate players and available time slots for the date and course selected. It can also be used to quickly book reservations for open time slots by clicking on a time or open availability on the right side of the screen. Notifications can be used to send out messages to players about delays, etc. Handicap will access a member handicaps module screen if you have the module. Tournaments Highlight the tee times that will be part of the tournament and click the tournament button. This will open up the tournament setup window if you have the module. Block works similar to tournament where we can highlight the times we'd like to block and click that block button. Here you can configure the settings and specify the type of block to block out those tee times. So for example, due to course maintenance. Group. Highlight the tea time slots that you'd like to be part of a group, then click the group button. This will allow you to create a group booking under one player. The other player spots can be specified after the booking has been made by editing the reservation. Check-in. Here you can select a player, then click the check-in button to check them into the course. Note that check-ins can only be completed through point of sale, not through the tea time module. Cancel and no show. Similarly, you'll want to select a player, then click the applicable button to either cancel a reservation or indicate a no show. Delete. Here you can select a player, then click delete to remove the reservation from the tea sheet. The undo slash void button is used to undo or void a check-in or no show action done to a reservation. Message. Here we can select a player, click the message button to record and deliver a message to that player. Move slash copy. Select a player, then click the move slash copy button to move or copy that individual player's reservation to a specified course, date, and tea time. Reservation note. Select a player, then click Reservation Notes, so you can create or read notes for that reservation. If there is a reservation note and or message attached to that booking, icons will display in the reservation for you. <music>